Hey guys, let's look at how you can come up with an examination system using Microsoft Access, that is a professional uh, exam system, a system that you can share. So guys, I will first of all demonstrate on the system that I will be taking you through, that is from part one until the end. So you key in the password here, then once you key the password, uh, you will be in a position to have this module here. Therefore, you shall have this module. The module for max entry, the module for max sheets, and the module for uh, report forms or report cards. So guys, to start the system, uh, you just first of all uh, feed the students details. Uh, like now, you just feed guys here. Uh, this is the place you refer the the system you can also copy paste from Microsoft Excel and paste it here. So, so far I have three uh, students fed and then from there I just go to max entry. Therefore, this uh, dialog box pops up and then I just go to form four and then east. And now I have one class form four east. So once I do that, I then choose the term or semester. I have three semesters here or terms, so I choose term one, then hit on max entry. Therefore, once I hit on max entry, I'll be in a position to see the number of students that are in my system. So far, I have one, two, three. Then from there, you have the, the subjects, like for example, I need to feed some max so that you can see how this one works. So I just go to this one, this one I feed 85, this one... I feed 96. Then uh, you need to tap the marks to get to the system. Then I go to Kiswahili. Then Kiswahili, I feed 55. Then this one 56. Then I do the same. Then I go to mathematics. This guy has 56. This has 85. Like that, we feed the marks. Then I go to biology. Uh, this guy uh, is taking biology also. It's called 85, then this one is called 56, like that. Then, guys, we go ahead to chemistry. Chemistry, this is called that too. This is called 45, like that. Then I go to geography. Uh, this is called 50, this is called 40. Yeah, let's see if we, it's called 40. So, this, uh, that's then we go to CRE. This, for example, is called 78. This code 96, like that. Then we go to agriculture. We have this code 52, this code 41, that way. So, so far I have fed my marks, therefore I need to hit on cross. Then once I do that, now I can go to mark sheet and I can produce the mark sheet for that class. For example, form for, I just go to form for uh, east. Form for east, then uh, I choose end term, end term. Then I just go to results and then wait for the mark sheet to uh, populate. So, so far, guys, the system is populating the, the mark sheet. And for that case, uh, the mark sheet is here, guys. So far, now you can see uh, these three guys here have been aligned, and then you can see position one, position two, position three and also with their mean score. So that is the uh, mark sheet. So after doing that one, I cross that. Then, for example, I want to produce the report card or the report form of these guys or any of these guys. For example, now I just go to this module here. Then I just type the year 2022, and that is 2022. Then I choose the class. They are in form four. Uh, semester, they are in semester one class it is for east then for example i want specifically to produce the port form for seven that nine then i just hit on card uh add per admission number or per registration number so after doing that guys uh the system will now populate the uh, report card therefore this is the report card guys therefore you can see this is for don gichai 739 and then you add down here you can see uh there is this guy's position one 
Uh, okay, this one is erroneous since I had deleted some data. But basically, this is very correct. You can see the marks, the total marks. You can see the total points and also the mean grade. Then here, you can see the comparison of the KCP marks with Avis term 1 in form 4. So guys, I uh, will be taking you through how to come up with uh, an examination system that is using Microsoft Access. So guys, don't forget to subscribe and also to turn on the bell so that once I post the videos, you will be in a position to get alerts and also uh, get a chance to learn how to do the coding of this system. Basically, the system will be using Microsoft uh, Access and a bit of VBA, that is the Microsoft uh, Visual Basic for application. So guys,